It's uh, Saturday, December 21st, and this is an update on Miss Lula, the uh, female great horned owl that I picked up a week ago from the Gainesville ER clinic. And um, she just tangled with somebody. We have no idea the kind of critter she tangled with, but she seemed to be on the losing end in that um, she is all torn up, all scratched and lacerated on her feet and on her breast. and. That's where, while her feathers were matted underneath, uh, you can see that she's starting to pull them out. Um, and, uh, you know, she's starting to feel better, so she's preening. Um, I just wonder what the other quitter looked like when they got done scrapping. But anyway, um, something uh, uh, compromised her enough that she was too sore to uh, to get up and continue to fly so she was slowly starving to death um, so I can feel by her keel and of course all the food she's eating this week that she's starting to gain sufficient weight um, so we've got rain coming in tomorrow but after that um, Monday or Tuesday I'll be able to put her outside and she has enough meat on her bones now that um, she can keep her body system going and um, you know, and, and won't feel any uh, adverse effects from the cold weather. So, I know she's being a good girl. Her her um, mucous membranes are all nice and pink now, and she just has a. She's very patient. Um, she's got a great attitude. So, uh, I just wonder what in the world are we going to do with her when it comes time to release? Because we don't know where she came from. So, anyway, we'll. Um, We'll figure that out when we get around to it. Oh, and she, um, her, this is her first hairball. It's huge. Look at this big old thing. Isn't that cool? Anyway, I think it's cool. You either love them or hate them. It's a hairball sort of thing. What is it, Miss Lula? Okay, I've got breakfast on. That's it from Hawk Talk.